Okay. Making time. On the pizza, we shall have palm ham, mozzarella. We're using strong white flour, easy by yeast because we're lazy. <laughs> and we're gonna have da, 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 da. some shredded chicken, some peppers, and the creme de la creme wild mushrooms. Freshly picked last week. Hey, how many people are you? How many people are you? Hey, Maurice, get the pepper. Get the pepper. She wants the parmesan. I'm going to have a crumb. So big, doesn't even fit on the plate. <laughs> so I'm back outside Iron House Gym uh, at the moment. Um, some of you might be wondering why I'm wearing a grenade uh, t-shirt. It's because we're actually using a uh, grenade 50 cal today. Um, giving that a go for a bit of a pre-workout. Uh, I've used it before, but quite a while ago. So what I'm going to do, I've got some C4 as well. Um, there's a few other trial pre-workouts. So I'm actually going to do a review of uh, all of those in the next coming uh, weeks or so. So we're going to whack this uh, pre-workout done. Uh, we're going to go for a chest and tricep workout today. Um, we had a refeed yesterday um, and we had a night out, um, went out for dinner and started to have a, I had a not very nice calzone. Um, so anyway, we're going to get this done, we're going to get some loads of footage for you today because I think it's very relatively um, quiet in there. So we'll get that done now and I'll catch you guys in the gym in a few moments. How are we doing then guys? Um, so, Iron House Gym. I actually really love this place, um, mainly because the only time I come here is on a Sunday and so far every time I've come here on a Sunday it's been empty. I absolutely love it. Um, so it pretty much means I can do whatever I want, when I want, without any worry about anybody else really. Um, so I took full advantage of that and pretty much just played about with um, different weight, different techniques, different, um, well yeah, just, just have played around really guys, see kind of test the waters with um, different kind of movements, um, basically just find out what really works for me, um, to be honest with you. So as you saw there, we started off with some flat bench, so um, I did actually have about over an hour's worth of footage um, for this, so rather than putting up an hour long video um, I've cut this down to around about 10 minutes long um, we're just shy of so I've selected kind of the uh, the best um, two sets of each exercise that I did um, there are a few that I didn't exercise that I didn't catch as well on video um, but pretty much you got the the, uh, the bench press there I believe I ran uh, about four or five sets on that um, very Varying the uh, the weight, alternating all the weight all the time, um, and then we went on to the incline dumbbell press. Now, um, I was I did play around with the the incline uh, on this, um, and I found that um, I almost like it just above flat. Um, it really gives a, a nice burn to the upper part of my chest, which is really what I'm trying to work on at the moment. Um, but again, alternating the work, the um, the weight itself, um, the number of reps, that sort of thing. Um, just basically trying to find out what really works best for me and just pushing boundaries. Um, taking the grenade um, pre-workout was actually amazing. I had such a, an amazing pump from it. Um, it really did work for me um, on, on this day. Um, and again, I had a carb refeed the day before. So um, both kind of probably helping each other, um, which meant I felt really full today uh, on this day. Uh, and really going hard. Um, so after that, we hit some triceps. So we um, we hit uh, the cable pull downs. Um, started off with some um, rope pull downs, and then we moved on to using um, a wide bar. The reason why I like using the wide bar is basically um, I feel like I've got a wider grip, and therefore I can I can pull more. 
um, and it gives a really, really good burn on the triceps. Um, so I did that. I actually spent quite a lot of time on that um, for this particular exercise. Um, I think I did about seven or eight sets, and it just felt good. It just felt um, a really good burn. Um, so just went with it. Just just kept playing around with the weight, um, see what happened, really, and see what worked for myself. So um, what also happened, actually, on the day... Um, because I was the only one in there, the guy at the front desk um, actually let me just play whatever music I wanted out loud. Um, so, which is why at the start of the video, you probably didn't hear very much in the background. Um, but I've actually had to mute everything on this, obviously, because of the, the royalties thing. So, um, I was blaring out um, Linkin Park Hybrid Theory, the full album, which was absolutely insane. Literally a full blast. Absolutely loving it. Um, and then I went on to Eminem's recovery album again, awesome. Um, but just because it's so empty, um, I just got uh, the benefit of playing my own music out was just really good. It may may have helped with the pump a bit, but I was just absolutely loving it. If I'm honest, absolutely loving it. Um, so from there we went um, to wide cable pull downs um, for the chest, um, and then we went for the lower. Uh, I like doing the lower uh, as well because I feel like this really hits the upper part of the chest. Um, so we did a fair few number of sets on this um, as well. Uh, from there, I do believe, we, there we go, we went on to um, Skull Crushers. Now this is something that I don't do very often. Um, so I played around with this, played around with the weight quite a lot um, to see what really worked for me. And um, I did push it a little bit too far, tried to do 40k. Um, and I almost dropped the weight on my head, um, which would not have been a pretty sight to be honest, but I didn't catch that on video, so uh, <laughs> unfortunately you guys won't be able to see that. Um, but yeah, just played around again, and this is definitely something that I want to really start doing more in my workouts um, for the triceps. So it's a really good movement. Um, I'll probably try it with uh, dumbbells as well at some point actually, um, get some more isolated movement on the individual arms. Probably be quite beneficial um, to do that. Uh, so yeah, well, how long was I here for? I think it was about two hours in total I was here for. Um, I've got chatting to the guy at the front desk quite a lot, so um, kind of wasted time chatting away. But because it's empty, I didn't really care. Just just doing what what felt good and such. Um, then I finished the triceps off with some dips. Side off with uh, just body weight dips, and then moved on to weighted dips. Uh, I think I pushed up to around about um, 45k um, using. Um, a dipping belt. Um, unfortunately, the footage wasn't in focus like it is here, which was really annoying because um, I really, really did push it and it really felt absolutely awesome. Um, from there, you'll see later on in the video, I went on to uh, incline, um, what's it called, chest press again. Um, this was a machine, if you like. I don't really know what it's called actually. Um, Plenty of sets again on there, uh, just really giving it a burn, um, quite lightweight to finish, just to get a, a finished burn um, to finish off the workout. So after this, um, there's actually some footage of my current form as of um, as of this workout, which I'll which will be coming up in a moment. Um, but seriously, guys, thanks so much for watching. Uh, I really appreciate you guys, um, your support and such that the people. Um, that you guys have given me so far, uh, Facebook, Twitter, and that sort of thing, the messages I've been receiving have been awesome. Um, it's uh, half past 10 on Wednesday the 10th, so really apologies for taking so long to upload this. Um, but yeah, guys, please do like and subscribe. Um, I do absolutely love um, hearing from you. Um, so do comment below, um, and I'll catch you guys soon.